First on Fox tonight, a wild standoff with Phoenix police today. A suspected robber leads police on a bizarre chase. Then I'm Christina Carrilla. The man ended up dangling and climbing rooftops in downtown Phoenix. This all happening off 7th Street near Portland and Roosevelt. Jennifer Martinez is live with the details on what happened. Jennifer, this was a wild scene. Yeah, it was definitely a wild scene and this is where that arrest happened and it's something that we don't see quite often. As you guys mentioned, that alleged suspect, he was climbing on power lines, taking police on a huge long chase. Dramatic video of Phoenix police taking down an armed robbery suspect using less lethal force. We came home and there was a man on the roof I didn't know that, but all of a sudden Phoenix police were surrounded. We didn't know if he was armed or not, but we all, they said, get back inside the house. The man walking along power lines, eventually sitting on the roof of an apartment complex near North 7th Street in Portland, jumping off the roof, sliding down cables and into the hands of multiple police officers. Police say officers tried to negotiate as he made his way across rooftops and power lines before shooting a less lethal weapon. It was de-escalated. No one was hurt. No one was shot. I didn't see anything disrespectful. Um, and it's nice to see that in our neighborhood where there's a, there's a lot of problems. Todd says he called the police after recognizing the suspect from a previous encounter. He gave me eye contact, said what's up, and then he kept walking, and I was, I was like, that's him. So I called the cops, stole my car at gunpoint yesterday. Witnesses nearby say the incident lasted for at least an hour, applauding officers. Um, honestly, I was really impressed with how they handled the whole situation. He was multiple times able, they could have shot the guy out of the way and had the situation dealt with. They were patient, they waited him out. They made sure he was okay. They rubber bulleted him when it was safe and they effectively made sure the guy was safe. Now that suspect was taken to a local hospital with minor injuries where he will be booked into jail. Reporting live in Phoenix, I'm Jennifer Martinez with Fox 10 News.